Hey, welcome back to Contractor Corner. I'm Gary Parker, joined today with Frank D. Benedetto, Director of Connected Solutions here at Watts. Frank, Watts is known by and large for products and solutions, tried and true, valves, you got pipes, fittings, all the, all the traditional things that you would have that go into a mechanical system. Mm -hmm. But we're bringing the IoT world onto those traditional plumbing solutions. Tell me a little bit about it. Watts has been in the forefront of helping the contractors and, and building you know, code and, and, and institutions for 148 years plus. Long time. And over the years, Watts has kind of expanded its reach in technology, getting into you know, electromechanical devices. You know, we make a number of thermostats. We do stuff with snow melting today. We do control systems. All the way down to even uh, chemistry uh, testing for shipborne uh, bilge pumps. So how do we get the smartphone and the IoT of things onto those traditional tried and true pro plumbing products and solutions? We start out with trying to understand the problem the customer has, okay. or, or the problem the industry has, if we look at the holistic picture. You know, by and large, a lot of the mechanical valves that Watts produces, because there's such a rigid code, spec code behind that to make sure the products can pretty much operate and have certain fail safes. Mm -hmm. So like backflow preventers, when they discharge water, they're doing their job. Right. Uh, pressure regulators, they need to maintain and control, and there are some fail safes, especially with like ACVs, where the devices can operate. The devices are somewhat mechanically autonomous, so even though the industry kind of has worked and involved to repair and install them, a lot of people don't realize how they actually operate okay. and how they actually affect or are dependent on the plumbing system. So by enabling them with some connectivity, IoT solution, bringing information out of them, putting that into somebody's phone or tablet or, or a computer, now we're beginning to allow them to see what's going on with their system mm -hmm. and understand what the operation that one component or multiple components are doing within that solution. So in essence, you're really giving them more visibility to the entire system and they could be far away from it or they could have somebody on site, but they can help monitor things more closely. Correct. Right? Just by, with a few pushes. Yes. One layer of that is, again, maintaining what the product does mechanically. So no matter what we do with connecting the product, it still fundamentally has to comply to the product standards that it's certified by. It. So example, we have the Century Plus. Yep. You know, that's a combination of a backflow preventer with an ACV valve that has a sensor for drain. So if a flood is detected, we, by code, can't physically shut the check valves off inside the backflow preventer because then that would not make the backflow preventer that would compromise its safety. But however, it, it shuts down a valve in front of the device or downstream of the device to stop the water. So those are kind of ways that mechanically we're able to bundle systems together, mm -hmm. make them work together, and then provide that, that connectivity information to the customer, but not compromise the fundamental safety requirement of the product. So you think about you think about you as a contractor, contracting firm, going to a customer, you know, establishing a contract for, for plumbing maintenance. You know, there's a lot of things. You go in, you fix the job today, mm -hmm. you walk out, something else could happen. It'd be nice to have that that insight. Sure. And that's where connecting or IoT products come into play. I'll give you a quick example behind me here is the Intellistation, you know, Powers brand product deals with digital mixing. So example is you'll have a couple of these products most likely installed in a commercial building, or let's say it's a hotel, and you may be supporting the mechanical plumbing uh, contract for that, that establishment. Mm -hmm. Well, having this connected to your uh, mobile phone or application, you can get notifications ahead to say, hey, temperature is uh, offset. So you can already look in through the application and understand, okay, is my master mixer operating correctly? Mm -hmm. Before you get a phone call from your customer saying, hey, I'm not getting hot water. So rather than being reactive as some of these things used to be, and you, you get the call or it's two in the morning and there's a maintenance issue or there's a pressure fluctuation, you can actually be a little more proactive. Correct. Okay. And then that also plays into maintenance. Sure. So a lot of these agreements that contractors will have with establishments, you know, customer sites is all around maintenance and making sure their customers have uptime. Mm -hmm. So by having the product connected remotely, you're able to monitor this. So again, taking Telestation into it has reports. You can see what trends look like. You can see if there were anomalies that occurred off hours, you know, why is, why is the temperature running hot at midnight? Mm -hmm. Nobody's using the water. Maybe there's a leak. Maybe something else is going on. So it's better then to get that visibility back to the maybe the hotel manager or somebody and do a preventative maintenance before you're waking up the next morning and nobody's got hot water in the building. One of the most powerful things for contractors is contractors build a relationship with their customers. That's right. Build a trust. So the, con the customer's trusting them that they understand their plumbing. 
What's better to have another digital tool now that gives you fair warning or more information about the system you're trying to manage? It's, it's, it's extremely powerful. Love it. Frank, I appreciate you coming by today. Yep. New England zone. Love the accent. We'll see you next time on Contractor Corner.